There he goes, he go away for four. Only the two slips in. He went for the drive, got a good genuine outside edge. The Australians are taunting him on the offside there, asking him to hit over the top. And he does beautifully, well played. One bounce over the rope. Four. <laughs> what a beauty. Crunches one straight out of the middle. Don't worry about taunting him. He had it on his mind ever since starting this innings. That's the shot he wants. Almost carried. He wasn't that far from being six. Gave himself some width on the onside. Freed his arms up and bang. He goes again. That's going for the smoke carry. Will it? Will it? Will it? Yes, it does. Well played, Ganguly. Taking on Gillespie. And proud of loving it. I think two of the biggest square boundaries we'll see in the country as well here in Brisbane. He's made it look like a normal ground. Brisbane cricket ground now is very wide and the ropes are in five or ten metres but still as big as we've seen all of a sudden ten runs off two deliveries well, that's absolutely smashed and along the ground the whole way Brad Williams might have said something to Ganguly last over and Gooley didn't really need to respond after hitting that shot it's a battle that Ganguly has won I think not played too well on that occasion and Brad Williams has had the last say Ganguly is gone with the short pitch delivery right at him. Excellent bowling from Brad Williams. It's a line that I think Australia should be bowling at Indian captain for a lot longer. Over leg stump, not outside off stump. The Indian captain who loves playing square the wicket on the offside has nowhere to go. So there's three big shots. Finished with uh, the court and bowl by Brad Williams out for 18. That's a good shot. Not ducking on this occasion. Saw that very early. Oh, that's a grand shot. That field will be a little bit slow with all the rain. One for 54. That's oh, a great shot. Four starting to come thick and fast now. Tendulkar has hurt his ankle there in playing that shot. I think he's asking for some tape. He's either going to need a tape or a runner. One of the two. This is a beautiful back foot square cut. Obviously quite a lot of pain when he has to put his weight on that back right foot. That's when the ankle will be tested the most. And obviously it's worrying him at the moment. There's only one man who can run for him. And that's the captain because he's out. Can't send in any of the guys still to come. I always saw Rav Ganguly. I'll be sending out all sorts of doctors and medical staff to get it right. Square cut. Beautiful shot. He just has to put so much weight and nearly all his weight on that right foot. Bringing about quite a bit of pain, such as Tendulkar. That's a great shot as well. This is the danger for Australia. That he'll think, well, I don't want to be running too much. I better hit all boundaries. Where the injured player, they used to always say. That's a good shot. He thought it was going for four when he hit it and then started to accelerate a little bit. With five boundaries in the last two and a half overs. A worrying sign for the Australians. Lovely shots, though. Sort of stood to attention there. Such a tendulka. Four more. This is glorious batting. That's a great shot. He really is in top class form, BBS Laxman. Oh, that's beautifully played, and it's four. I think uh, the problem there for the fieldsman at uh, backward point was that the ball was going so fast he actually took off and as Damien Martin there took off and the ball actually went flying past him before he had time that's his off century Sachin Tendulkar hobbles down for a single and uh, everyone right across the continent of India and certainly in this ground all his supporters will be very happy with this, and he's not finished yet. Yep. Beware the injured batsman. Made a brilliant 50 from just 53 balls, carrying an injury. In the air, but safe. Beautifully played. Doesn't have to run for that. Wafted off drive. Superb placement. Nice shot. Lovely still body when hitting the shot, and a still head. No overbalancing at the end of the shot. In the air, and got him. Cotton Bart and Dorka trying to get on the back foot there to heave that one down the ground. Sachin Tendulkar is looking for a little bit of spin to get it down mid on, mid wicket. 86 with an injury. Horton bowled Simons. Well, that's nicely cut. This might go to the boundary for four. He's got that into the right place. Yes, it's gone. Well, that's a much needed boundary. Very quick learner, Rod Dravid. That'll be four. Gilchrist is annoyed, but no slip. Cost them. It's two for 211. Oh, 
good save. And good combination. That'll be 50 for Rahul Dravid. Better than run a ball, just the one boundary. A very useful innings, two for 243. First ball, Britley's over, smashed to deep point. And coming back for two. Throws the bowlers in. says, I'll have a look. Dravid wanted two from the moment he hit the ball. Well, that's beautifully bowled again. It's going to cost him four runs. No luck at all there for Britley. The previous one just missed the stumps. And that one's missed the stumps as well and gone for four. It's in the air. Gillespie is too square, though. Races to 86. It's in the air. It's picked the gap between well, the two men, one at square leg and one at mid wicket. And raced away for four. Well, Australia's just put the third man up inside the circle to play an extra man on the leg side boundary. It still didn't work. Inside the rope as we speak, they've gone back to the old stuff. He goes again. That'll be four more. It's good hitting from Rahul Dravid. Noted big hitter. It's two boundaries in a row. Brilliant stroke play. Seems to be able to place it at will. Just brought that man up. You can't afford to bowl there. It needed to be up a little fuller. And this one could well be out. Brad Williams. Oh, Dravid, a little disappointed. He didn't hit the third boundary in the road. He's done a good job for India. Dravid not happy. The Australians will take it. Three for 280. Oh, beautifully hit. He's a great player to watch. VVS Laxman. Now rated into the 90s. 94. I'd hope Brett Lee is trying to bowl Yorkers, that's it. But he's bowled bounces now in slot. He's flicked that away. He's got better than one. He's got four. Lovely use of the wrists. Yeah, Brett Lee is copying the brunt of this wonderful batting. 13 off this over so far. His figures are up into the 80s. No wickets next to his name. Oh, they fiddled with their fine leg fieldsmen a couple of times, but India have been able to play it squarer or finer, whatever's needed. Last ball. Oh, he's bowled him. And he's got it right this time, Brett Lee. It's 147 k's. Straight and full. Brett Lee will finish with figures of 1 for 83 from his 10 overs. Didn't quite know what he was looking for this time, Yuvraj Singh. He got the short one, the ball before. Not last ball of the innings. 4 for 299. Laxman, 99 not out. Harvey the ball. Oh, take that. That's well over the infield. One, two, three bounces. And into the rope. And that's a brilliant 100 for BBS Laxman. 100 from 113 balls faced. Brings it up from the last four of the innings. And he now has three one-day national hundreds. All scored against Australia. Well played. And to that man, BBS Laxman. Without him, the three figures wouldn't have been reached. The Australians struggled in the field on a very, very good batting pitch because Dravid and Laxman gave them nothing. Julian Tenduka started well. Tenduka made 86 and also injured himself in the process. Dravid a very useful 74. And all the bowlers, apart from probably Jason Gillespie, suffered Lee, 1 for 83 from 10. 4 for 303 India. So Australia will need to make 304 runs tonight. Yes, the Indian bowlers must have known that this was going to happen. A little bit of swing there for Patan, which will encourage him. Chance at mid on. Is the one they wanted. Well, either one of the two. Hachi has, uh, well, in all his excitement, he's gone down on his knees. Dual Chris, the man, miscuing there. He's gone. That's the end. Big wicket. Three for 94. Driving square. Well caught in the gully. The Indians on fire. Like a rocket was going towards backward point and uh, beautifully taken. Yuvraj Singh makes a big difference in the covers to the side. This is what uh, he said to him. Good luck. Have a good lung, mate. Have a good lung. Good one, mate. Out he went, and uh, now the Indians are just slightly in front here. Big cover drive. There's only a small gap there. He's found it. 100 up. Andrew Hayden's played beautiful tonight. That one's gone past the catching man at mid-wicket. No wonder it's gone past because it was careened. He's looking to get forward here. Well, he's off the front foot, really. He's a metre and a half out of his crease, playing a pull shot. To have the time to do that is a great skill. A few Indian fieldsmen thinking that was a chance, but that's just hit too well. Oh, and uh, he's caught him. That's out. Caught and bowled. That's a very good catch. Well, the wicket in his first over, and uh, just 
seemed to me just a little bit slack there. That shot played straight back. Just watch this. It's turning away from him a bit. Did he close the face? Well, he just popped it back and it was nicely taken. One-handed. It went back quicker than he thought. That's a very, very good catch. Good delivery. It just curved in on um, Andrew Simons just a little bit and enough spin to get the leading edge. But the catch was the brilliant part. It's a sweep shot in the edge in the gap. It's going to go for four. And races to 98 with a superb shot of the two men out. 10 metres apart, which is his highest score in Australia in a one-day game. Has scored 100. This field, that there's one short called the ball before. Commentators are bamboozled, the crowd are bamboozled. They get a chance to clap a second time now. Here they go. It was Matthew Hayden's in too that touched a little short when he was on 99. In the air, nobody out there. That'll go all the way for four, at least. In fact, it is a four. And Clark doing the job. Good supporting role. This was a single to make him 99. Deemed not to have made it over that line totally. In the air, man down there, should get to it, should catch it. Oh! There goes the ball game, one would feel. That was a sitter. Bawaji straight down his throat, first ball back. And what a miss. Gone this time, big wicket. Good comeback by the young ladies, only 19. And he's got a big wicket. Get down on the field, has responded with a good and the tired Hayden departs. Superb bowling from a teenager. Right down on the boundary, Matthew Hayden, outside edge. Good bowling, Patan, short of a length. Hayden looking to force on the up. Patan and keeper. Hayden and his Queensland crowd. He goes for it. And finds the gap. That's an excellent shot. The tactics that Ganguly wanted his bowler to bowl at leg stump. Clark was too good. That was a beautiful shot. Oh, he's got that fine Michael Bevan. And he'll get a boundary. Not the start the captain was after. Bevan is so experienced. We've seen him play quite calmly in difficult situations. And there's a big edge on that. Yes, there certainly is a big edge on that. Stood his ground, it was a wide delivery, and he couldn't fool Steve Buckner. Uh, with that wicket, India's chances have increased, and Australia are going to struggle from now on. Bevan will have to take a in the air, and it's in the gap, it's four, that's Bevan at his best. The final delivery, the Pumbai whipped away beautifully. In the air, man out there getting under it, should be out, he is, big wickets. Harvey finds Gavasco on the fence at 7 for 249. 55 on a 44 required. Big wicket. He's gone for it, and that's a very well hit. It's a very good hit. Over the big back left and then bang. And it comes up. Yep. And presses it to deep cover. And they get two. There's a chance to run the bowls of the throw. It's good. Got to be close. It's got to be close to out. Very close. I think that's out. I think it was a very good throw, and I think it's Kavaska again. Under pressure, keeping his cool. The throw was near the bales. The bowler did well. And where's the batsman? He's out. Is he? No. It's quote. Oh, what a photo finish. Where's the bale? Doubt whether they'll give that out. It was an excellent piece of uh, fielding. The throw was right next to the stumps. The Balaji was in the right position. But... Jason Gillespie had just stretched out enough. Great running by the big man, he's happy, he's great catch under pressure. Yes, he covered a lot of territory, he's come from the cover position. But the important thing is here, he wanted the ball. He was off immediately, not hanging around waiting to see if somebody else was going to get there. Patan kept his eye on it all the way, and a good catch. So the young guys are doing a terrific job in this situation for India. It's 9 for 282. Yorker, this should be run out surely. That's it, that's the end. A big win by India. They win by 20 runs, well deserved. Great batting. Attacked early on by Gilchrist and Hayden. And that's a big, big victory for India. One day level. Excellent Yorker there.
from Patan, they produced the hit. It's a good win to India. They batted very well. Uh, they bowled extremely well. Most of their fielding was good. They've certainly deserved this victory. Laxman and Tendulkar uh, setting it up, setting a very good foundation early on. The young bowlers have been the ones that have been impressive in these final few overs. And uh, Rohan Gavaska making a good debut. Got a wicket, brilliant court and bowled and did some good work in the outfield. So it's been an impressive victory uh, by India, particularly because the youngsters have contributed so much to the victory. So a very good all-round performance. It was a batsman's pitch here today at the Gabba. They defended 303. They got a big victory.